Anyways, hello gamers. Welcome back to Super Mario RPG Masters. The game that decided the difficulty doesn't need to exist anymore. <laughs> and, and yet this game is- this, this hack is still pretty fun, honestly. Like, I'm- I'm just here to see some of the new stuff, honestly. Because there's a lot of- there's a lot of good new stuff in this hack. Like, um... I like some of the new enemies that have shown up. <laughs> what- what's wrong, Seb? What's wrong? <laughs> Is there a problem with me playing Mario RPG? Oh, that's- that's the same. <laughs> that's an awakening. Alright, how bad are the, how bad are the dogs gonna be? Oh hey look, we got the unused radish. You're sad? Why? <laughs> you know, let's see how much ice blast does. I well, you know at least one of these guys is gonna be weak to ice. And they're still alive somehow. How are you guys still alive? <laughs> um, your girlfriend got grounded? Mm. <laughs> Take your anger out on Zack or someone instead. <laughs> Toxic gas. I mean, it's, it's fine. I, I guess- I guess I'll be your, um... I guess I'll be your person to vent to. It's fine, Zack's ghosting me right now anyways. So, yeah. <laughs> I asked him an hour ago if he was free, and he didn't respond, so I'm assuming he's dead. <laughs> so I'm playing Mario RPG instead. Holy shit, that damage. See, so yeah, I just add radishes. Um, to the lo to loadouts randomly. That's cool. Well, Elijah's here. <laughs> so that's someone you can talk to. Let's get rid of that bee. The bee is still alive, guys. We gotta get we gotta, gotta get that bee out of here. Or else we'll all be fucked. What the fuck? That was unexpected. Oh no, you guys are gonna heal? Hell no. Nah. Hell no, nah, we can't be having that. Actually, that bee doesn't really do that much damage. <laughs> Why are you going UI on Jacob? Yeah. I'm, like, always available. Scroll bell? And, and I'm, uh... I, I'm a scarecrow now, I guess. The thing is, the, the shadow on the, the radish kind of broke. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm getting money for days, though. Check this shit out. I was gonna ask Zack to finish his fucking rando run, but... I don't know, he's AFK, so... Not my problem, I'm gonna play this game instead. <laughs> well, and also, Jose's been ghosting me too. Everybody's been ghosting me, it's just been a sad time. Seb's good though, he hasn't been doing that. What's up? Anyways, what's your question? <laughs> oh yeah, let's let's try fighting the shy away. Everybody has this fucking attack. <laughs> oh my god, Mallow just can't. He just he's so frail. Would you kiss a dude for ten bucks? Nah, man, it'd have to be like a thousand bucks for me to do that. Oh, sorry, Fly Guy. Now it's Fly Guy. Now here's a question. <laughs> yeah, a thousand bucks to guess a dude. 
No exceptions. <laughs> He'll do it for free. Also, I'm not taking any damage here. Well, here, 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 here's the thing. I'll make an exception if it's a, uh, if it's a, you know, can it be a female to male? Does that count? <laughs> also, why are you guys spamming, uh, sad songs at me? Who do you think you are? <laughs> yes. Can I do that for a thousand bucks? Because that's, that's the f most free thousand bucks I've ever had. See, I'm actually using, uh... I'm actually using the power of the LGBT to my advantage. <laughs> and there's the cricket gem. Good lore, what is this loadout? <laughs> so we have we have two fly guys, a Criffid and a Radish. Which by the way, guys, if you don't remember, <laughs> the Radish is um an unused enemy. And the guy said, like, hey, you know, let's put let's put the radish in here. Oh, we got an ad. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you know, I won't comment any further because I don't want to piss off, um, I don't want to piss people off. Because you know how people are. That's a lot of damage. I feel like they kind of expect you to have at least one of these items by this point. <laughs> Get this damn Valorant ad away. Well, not my fault Twitch is playing Valorant ads. I would have, yeah, you know, I would have preferred a more personalized ad experience. This is this is a case where I wouldn't mind, you know, them, you know, being creepy and, you know, playing ads based on your preferences because who the fuck wants Valorant? <laughs> you know, Dom's sad. You know, when you say Dom's, do you mean Dominic? <laughs> I don't think Dominic's very sad. And again, uh... You know... Oh. There goes, like, half of Mallow's health. <laughs> check stream chat. Hold up. I will check stream chat in a sec here. Is he actually sad? What, what happened? <laughs> I lost. <laughs> Wait, yeah, he said he he did. He posted a sad emote. Womp womp. I don't know. Yeah, he's, he, yeah. Chat room, not not stream chat. Wrong chat, bro. Good lord. <laughs> I'm honestly wondering, wondering if I should keep Mallow in, if he's gonna take this much damage. I love how they, I love how they just gave everybody the multi-strike move, but it's not even called multi-strike anymore, it's just a normal attack. Yeah, I'm fine with that. <laughs> the fucking multi-strike is so funny. Alright, do Galaxy Blast instead, because it does more damage. I don't even have to play the game, bro. Alright, how close are we to the next level? Um... We're actually getting pretty close. Although... We don't learn our next spell for a really long time, unfortunately. Here, let's let's heal everybody up, too. I do have a flower box in case I run out of FP. Dominic is a free-to-play gambler. Oh yeah, yeah, he he's been playing um Fire Emblem Heroes a lot. <laughs> 
Fire Emblem Heroes is, um, I don't know. It's a gacha game, though, so I kind of don't approve that much. But since it is Fire Emblem, I, I get a pass. It gets a slight more of a pass from me. <laughs> but still inexcusable. Anyways, here's one of my least favorite loadouts in the game. The frickin' three shoguns. These guys suck. And I wish they all die. Unless I can kill them all with an ice blast. <laughs> okay. You know what? That's easy. Ooh, wait, hang on. Should we fight formless, or is that a bad idea? Honestly, that might be a bad idea, because I haven't saved in a little while. Never, I've never used items this much in Mario RPG before, but here we go. <laughs> Fuck Byleth. I mean, Bi true, Byleth is in uh, Fire Emblem Heroes. So, technically, um, you could say that. Byleth is just such a... <laughs> Hang on. Um, let me see. <laughs> yeah, I hate gotcha shit, too. Fuck Byleth. Well, you guys should have seen my Fire Emblem waifu tier list this morning. I called I called by like a literal walking chalkboard. <laughs> and it was pretty funny. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna post that. In, I'm gonna post that in the chat room because I don't think anybody else has seen it. I'll let people. Uh, I'll let people um, feel like that. Spicy takes. <laughs> and I'll post the uh, engage one too. I ain't reading all that. Okay, fine. Have have the if I have the fire and we'll engage one too then. There you go. You guys can have a look at that while I'm playing Mar RPG. Hey man, Fire Island's got a lot of waifus. I, that wasn't even all of them. I had to. We had to stop at like the spinoffs <laughs> because I just like I gave up, bro. Because uh, I feel like Fire Emblem was one of those series where like you know the the. Gender ratio is pretty good. Smash or patch Pokemon? Am I smashing the Pokemon or am I smashing the, the girls in Pokemon? Because <laughs> that's a very different story. Anyways, guys, we're, we're about to come up on a uh, one of the best parts of the game. Oh, you know what? To be fair, I still have the forest cloak on everybody. It's kind of funny. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna do some grinding now because this part this part of the game is very fun to grind. <laughs> what kind of sicko? Okay, good. <laughs> I'm glad I'm glad I'm not gonna be Markiplier. Love of the game has to stop to register the fact that you um <laughs> you, you got almost, like so many level ups. I do both? No, shut up, man. I wouldn't do both. I wouldn't smash Pokemon. What do I look like? One of those weirdos that lewd Gardevoir? No. Alright, so if I'm correct, this guy should sell. He should still sell a star for 400. Which is good. So we can just get like a crap ton of level ups here. Alright, that was pretty good. Icy snowman! Hell yeah.
Alright, so now my question is... Oh, Mallow learned all his moves. That's pretty nice. Where the hell did all the moves go, then? <laughs> also, I need to check if Gino is about to learn anything good. Uh, Gino has all... Why, why do they have all their moves already? Is it because of the fact that, um... Did it have to do with the fact that the level cap is different? <laughs> let's see. Um, let's see. Uh, oh, you, wow, you, we, we're getting some, uh... We're getting some hot takes. Um... <laughs> if Cynthia is in S tier, you're getting blocked. Elijah, block me. Who's in your S tier, then? Cynthia's B tier. Hilda, Sonya, the bitch from Gen 7. You mean Gen 8? <laughs> Sonya's from Gen 8, bro. <laughs> the one with the shorts or the big brown blazer? Uh, you're gonna have to show me a pic of who you're talking about. Also, when did Bowser, Bowser get 360 HP? Hmm. If Peach learns a new move at level 30, I could swap, I could swap, um, her around with someone. I'm high, he meant both. Alright, anyways. I'm just gonna... Just gotta take an L real quick. It's gonna take a sec to die, though. This sound, this sound, this sound, this is fantastic to listen to. My ears are in joy right now. Alright. So, if Peach learns a new move at 30... Let's see if I can learn- let's see if I can get this. I might save state for this, let me see. Shit. I pressed the right button, right? There we go. Oh. <laughs> Going good so far, though. I think Bowser's the only one I'm actually going to give the POW level ups to. She learns a new technique at 30, yeah. I need to swap her around again. I want to give her move to someone else, like Mallow. I think that'd be kind of interesting. <laughs> Let's see. Why all the black bitches at the bottom learn to love chocolate? <laughs> I don't know, man. Th this, keep in mind, this isn't just, this wasn't just my list, it was also Zeppi's list. It was a bit of both. I love, I love the skill swap uh, glitch. It's very fun. Alright, let's see if I got it. So is Mallow gonna Mallow gonna be level 30 then? Bro, really? Ugh. Then I gotta I gotta die again then. Alright. Hey, at least Mallow dies really quickly. Alright. Let's get this over with. It's gonna take a bit longer to die, because I have to defend. Okay, there we go. I'm getting better at this.
that wasn't bad. <laughs> Zeppi forgot to turn off friendly fire. Uh, yeah, Zeppi, Zeppi's a bigger Fire Emblem fan than me, so he, he has, a uh, his opinions are gonna be more relevant, <laughs> because he actually knows what he's talking about. Damn, I got two levels there. Alright, Peach learns Sleepy Time. Wait, did I even do it correctly, then? Did I even do the- did I even do the glitch properly? Uh, oh, I did. <laughs> I did, I gave him sleepy time. <laughs> it did- so it did work, I gave- I gave Mal the sleepy time spell. That's pretty nice, actually. So now, look at how the spells Mallow has now. <laughs> Yeah, including Icy Snowman. Freeze your foes with a snowman. That might be good. Oh, also Healing Rain cures statuses now. So they, so they really buffed Mallow then. That's pretty good. <laughs> hey, considering the fact that, uh, considering the fact that Zeppi's black, I think he should have more, he should have more right to speak. Who is in my tier list? My Pokemon waifus. Um, hmm, that's a good one. I mean, I really like, um, I mean, I feel like I have, like, a couple from each gen that I really like. But, I'm trying, I'm trying to think off the top of my hood, like, who's my number one favorite? That green-haired Alola girl? Oh, Mallow. <laughs> So the the, uh, the experience curve kind of glitches out, actually, at this point. Yeah. Well, in terms of Alola girls, I prefer I prefer Lily. <laughs> That's just me. I think that's enough grinding. <laughs> Who? Lor Lorely? Are you talking about Lorelei from the Elite Four? <laughs> oh yeah, Sabrina is definitely like my pick for Gen One. All right, I can put the uh, I can put my equipment back on now. What did I have on Mario again? I had the rubber suit, right? I think I did. Um, Mario had the amulet, I think. Peach had the diamond ring, and Mallow also had the diamond ring. Wait, no, Peach had the amulet, didn't she? You know, it doesn't really matter. Plus, Mario having more stats is nice. <laughs> I, I, if you've seen this, the fan art of Sabrina, you might see why I, I feel the way I do. You know, let's try fighting, um... Well, if you get out of the loading zone, bro. All right, let's fight formless and see how badly this goes. So yeah, I'll have to send sauce later on. Oh, oh. he's blue now. <laughs> they changed Mokura to be blue. That's a funny change. Gas press. Uh oh. Oh. Wait. Why did that? Did that mute me? It looks like it feared me. It looked, it, it, I feel like it does all the statuses, actually. He was green before, because he's like a toxic cloud. Also, does jump work on him, by the way? I forget. No, no. Alright, well, uh, time to keep spamming Galaxy Blast, then. 
Also, that did not cure Milo's fear. What the fuck? Okay, let's do Data Drain and see how much health he has. Because he's an optional mini boss. He's either going to be really strong or really weak. 1200, so he's not very strong then. How much damage do we do normally? It's 66, that's like nothing, bro. No, this guy is kind of piss easy. I don't think this guy got modified at all. Oh yeah, the fear is still there. And I assume he's probably kind of resistant to ice. Because he's a weird magic mini boss. Okay, he's not feared anymore. Okay, <laughs> that was a lot easier than I was expecting. I got 20 experience, 100 coins, and a Star Carol Cola for free? Free? You got games on your phone? Oh yeah, by the way, we're in Balom Temple. It'll cost 50 coins to get your fortune told. <laughs> I usually just go left, middle, right, because it's like the fastest one, and it always gives you a good result. So, yeah, you got a Yoshi cookie. Oh, Mooney, I want Mooney. Give me that. Give me that Mooney. Yo, that was a lot of Mooney. Holy shit. Alright, good RNG. Good RNG, let's go. That's the kind of RNG you want to see in a rando. I, I think we're ready for Beloma, honestly. I can't imagine he'd do anything to screw us over. Defense effects. So what was the point? So, yeah, it said the diamond ring protects me against effects. So why did Mallow get feared then? Does it not protect against fear or something? I don't know, honestly. Anyways, Balome 2 shouldn't be anywhere near as hard as Balome 1. <laughs> Ironically. Forty-five hundred. Still gets multiple turns, though. Hypnosis. Well, the turn order is here. The turn order here is good. So, I can just get Mario back up. And we can just start spamming Ice Blasts and Galaxy Blasts and stuff. Oh, that also fears still. So I guess I'm not immune to fear or something. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I don't want to be feared, so I'm just gonna use Galaxy Blast. Okay, Galaxy Blast is doing 382 now, that's what I like to see. Monster is mute. Yeah, let's go. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Dominic says this is the perfect time to send Red Sad Ball. Marianne and Perry being a bad wife who's hate crime towards me, man. Hate speech not tolerate banned. Sent from my flame mobile. That was Zappy's fault. <laughs> If, 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 if he disagrees with anything, I'll just blame it on Zeppi. Because it's kind of true. Uh, 
Anyways, we're gonna be doing like a thousand damage per turn. Actually, almost 1200, actually. Bro, I swear to god, if this boss is easier than the below one, it's gonna be so disappointing. Did he get rid of the whole, like... Did he get rid of the whole, like, clone gimmick? Because I'd argue that makes this boss easier. Because the clone gimmick is arguably what makes this fight so hard in the first place. And I'm probably gonna get a drink. Like, I'm gonna get, like, some tea after this battle. And then I'm gonna show you guys some stuff after. Yep, sure, just keep just keep licking Mal, that'll do you good. Way too easy, bro. <laughs> Did not have made below me mean to mute. <laughs> or he should make him mean to mute, rather. Marius level 31. Alright. We gotta go to Monster Town now. Woo! Alright. Alright, well, I uh I fixed the lighting a little bit. So I opened my uh, blinds a little bit. Secondly, I have something to show you guys. So, as you guys know, I like to speedrun Paper Mario 64 a lot, right? And uh, there's a tracker that I always use, a tracker made by a person named Futon. I, uh, I've been using this tracker for a long time, like two years, probably more now. And, um,. There's, there's also a second Paper Mario randomizer tracker that uh, came out recently. And uh, it's made by a guy called Phantom. And uh, he actually runs the Paper Mario 64 randomizer a lot as well. And he also made a tracker. And I was like, surely if, you know, it's made by him, surely it has to be good, right? But, uh, I, I looked at it, right? And I first looked at it from, uh, Luke. Luke showed me the new rando. And I had a look at it, and I was like, man, this, this new tracker is really fucking messy. And I don't, I don't like it. So, the, the, the thing is, the reason why I was so conflicted is because... The current, the, the old tracker is missing a lot of, like, things that the randomizer added recently, like, for example, uh, it's missing Star Beam, because you can find Star Beam as a random item now. It's missing item pouches, and it's just missing a few other random little things. And I found the Star Beam icon on the new tracker, right? And I was like, that's honestly the only thing that the new tracker has that the old one doesn't have. Also, um, fun fact, I didn't know, but if you set this guy to Breeze, it actually makes the fans in Valentina's castle less aggressive. It's kind of interesting. So, I decided to put it upon myself to add some things from Phantom's tracker over to, um, Futon's tracker. Because I figured out how to edit the tracker. So, what I did was I um okay so it started out it, it started out like this right uh here's the tracker after I added the star beam right this is the tracker as it was before with star beam so I, I figured out how to add new shit to the tracker last night and that's what I was staying up la late last night for and I added the, the star beam icon right next to the seven star spirits and it, lo it looks pretty it looks pretty good there it actually doesn't feel out of place at all and I thought like, yeah, you know what? I think I'll just stop there. But then I kind of had the idea later. Um, also, Marissa just keeps falling over. Marissa, what are you doing? Come on. You need to um, you need to sit up properly. You know what? <laughs> sure, she can sit like that. So 
yeah, I fixed the tracker up and I put it like that. But then I decided maybe I should go a little bit farther and add a few things that are on either of the trackers. Because another problem I had with Phantom's tracker is it doesn't have Rip Cheeto on it. Because Futon's tracker has Rip Cheeto, but the other one doesn't. So both of them are kind of missing stuff that I feel like should be on there. So I took it upon myself to modify the tracker even further to make it the most perfect, ideal tracker for me. And this is the result that I came up with. This is the new tracker that we're going to be using from now on. I have added Starbeam to the top right. We have also added the item pouches, as you can see next to the Ultra Hammer. I wanted. I, I noticed that neither of the trackers have item pouches that you can mark off, and I thought... Oh, hello, chat member. <laughs> I thought that the item pouches were sorely lacking from either of the trackers, so I decided to manually add the item pouch to the tracker, and it counts all the way up to five, which is how many there are. So now, um, in addition to the boot and hammer progressions, uh, I'm also going to be tracking the item pouches, which is, uh, you know, really good. Uh, I've also kind of um, condensed the tracker a little bit to make it a little bit more um, less spacious. So everything is more condensed. Uh, one second, I'll be right back. My tea is done. Yeah, my, uh, my chat has been talking about, like, waifus and stuff like that. It's, it's, you know, pretty typical around here. But, um, as I was saying, um, I kind of made the berries a little condensed. I, I couldn't really figure out how to... I, my original idea was to make it so that the red and yellow berries would be marked off, and then you'd left click and right click for each blueberry. But I couldn't really figure that out. It kept on bugging out on me, so I decided to just give up and leave it like this. That's the only problem I have with the tracker right now, but if I can ever figure out how to fix it, uh, I'll go back to it. But lastly, this is the biggest new addition. We have the, what I like to call the necessary badges section of the tracker. <laughs> so at the bottom of the tracker are 16 badges that you would want to keep track of. These are all of the necessary badges that you would want for your rando run. And those being the three power pluses, all or nothing, PFD down, power rush, mega rush, the three defend pluses, last stand. Lucky day, I just kind of threw on there as a kind of little gag and a nod to how much Zach likes it, but it's there too. Uh, super jump charge, power bounce, D down jump, quake bounce, mega quake, the three flower savers, flower fanatic, and triple dip. In my opinion, those are like the 16 badges that you'd want for a rando run. So, they're on there. But yeah, that's, um... Those are the, uh... That's, that's the tr new and updated tracker. And honestly, I might also go back and edit the, um... Super Mario RPG tracker as well. Just in case I ever decide to run that rando again, because... I think the Super Mario RPG rando... Is a little too, uh... Is a little too big. And also, there's just some things that don't need to be on there. So, I'm probably going to take it upon myself and fix that up. So, yeah, I might do that, but that might be another- that might be later tonight, if Zack doesn't end up getting back to me. Because <laughs> I kind of get- I kind of give my friends, like, this new, um, this new rule. It's like, if you don't get back to me in an hour, I'm just gonna do a stream on my own and fuck you. <laughs> because I don't have the time to wait all day for a response. So, I kind of just do my own stream if they don't get back to me in time. Because, you know, I used to have that problem. And, uh, you know, I'd wait around all the time for my friends. But, I don't want to do that anymore. So, just decide. If they don't get back to me soon enough, I'm just going to play like RPG or something. Uh, we got Cos- wait, Cosmic Melody. Is that, um, is that what the Royal Syrup is now? I guess, yeah. That's a cool item. That's a cool name, actually. Gold Shroom. Oh, I am out of space. 
And a gold bar. Oh. <laughs> he replaced he replaced the fire blast with a gold bar. Interesting. In that case, it's probably time I sold some stuff. We gotta go to the shop anyway. So, it's all good. As if I didn't have enough money, I'm gonna be rolling in 5,000 bucks. Alright, here's the bad RNG. This is where runs would die. You get that and it wastes like three seconds every time. Which is not ideal at all. Alright. So we're gonna we're gonna go to the shop then. Actually, I wonder how hard is Jagger gonna be? Woo! <laughs> I missed a stream too. What was the hardest fight for you? Honestly, probably Bloom. <laughs> Bloom and Panderite were the hardest. Also, why are the triplets micro bombs now? <laughs> That's kind of funny. You have oh, you have the lucky hammer. All other stats seven lucky chance. Well, well, fuck, I'm just gonna buy that, then. That's a damn good weapon right there. Also, the bunny hood sells for a lot. I might keep it, though. Alright, sell the gold bar. Um, you know, honestly, you could sell these lime shrooms. We probably don't need those anymore. I could probably sell a Yoshi cookie and a Star Carol Cola. So now I got 6,000 bucks that I don't know what to do with. Chain Armor, Defense 14, Magic Defense 9, Speed minus 5, Null Thunder, and Jump Damage. Well, what enemy is going to be using Jump Damage against you? I don't know. Did they change that or something? Though that is pretty good. It's basically a better version of the Rubber Suit. You know what? I'm going to buy that. I'm going to buy that for... Uh... I'll buy it for Mallow and Mario, at least. Not the forest cloak, the chain armor. I mean, minus five speed isn't really a big deal. And Peach isn't really hurting, so... We're gonna do that. I'm gonna sell one of the forest cloaks, and I'm gonna also sell the rubber suit. Um... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Pandorite was still, like, one of the hardest bosses. It kind of got easy after that. And yeah, I'll sell these. I don't need them anymore. Uh, we also have Holy Water, Shroom Rain. None of this stuff is really that great. All stats plus 10. Null Ice become Element of Ice. I mean, all stats plus 10 is pretty good. I could swap the amulet out for that. Hmm, you know what? Hmm. I might get this for Mario, actually. And there goes my timer. Alright, that should be the last time I have to get up. I just, uh, finally got my tea. So, I am ready to drink tea. <laughs> so what do you have? Oh, you actually have the weapons. You have the weapons for Bowser. Brave Shell. Ooh. Now that's pretty good. I bet I'm broke now. <laughs> I mean, like, I could get the amulet. I could sell these. But let's be honest, am I really gonna use Bowser? No, probably not. Oh yeah, we could do the, uh... We could do the ghost hunting challenge as well. I'm the big boo. <laughs> the big boo. It's one of my favorite things to come back to this game for. It's just to read the name The Big Boo. <laughs> All well, the flags will be pretty easy to get. We I mean, I've played this game a bajillion times, so I already know where the, all the flags are. 
I'm just curious if the ghost metal's any better, or it's, you know, it's probably not even a ghost metal anymore. It's probably something else. I don't know. I don't know what it could be. But yeah, um, let's just save. <laughs> so we're level 31 now. That's pretty good, honestly. Alright, let's see how Jagger is gonna be. Jagger might be tough. We'll see, though. No way is Jagger gonna be tough, bro. What the hell? My sensei is out right now. I mean... Oh, okay. Oh! Oh, that that's quite a good start, huh? He's immune to jump. They deadass made Jagger harder, what the fuck? 6,000?! Okay, Jagger got a massive buff. You guys wanna know how much health he has in the original? 600. So they gave him 10 times as much. <laughs> 10 times as much health. He's also immune. Is he immune to ice too? He's not immune to ice. He's just immune to jump for some reason. Which means uh, Icy Snowman will do a good bunch. Actually, you know what? Let's try Sleepy Time. Missed. It missed, bro. Okay. Alright, well, Galaxy Blast it is, since that's the only option I have. Jesus. And he still attacks after that. Well, I can't even imagine to see what Jinx is gonna be like. Alright. Let's, let's see how much Ice Snowman does. Three oh six. that's actually pretty decent. That's one case where I actually feel like, um, we out-damage the, um, the, like, Galaxy Blast. Super Flare's gotta do something then, right? No, he's immune to fire, though, for some reason. Are you immune to lightning, too? So Mario is just dead weight in this fight. That's real fun. So Mario can't do shit in this level, in this this battle, basically. Very glad they made Jagger harder, though. That's always nice to see. Yeah, we're doing. Still doing a lot of damage, though. <laughs> Smite has to do a lot as well, right? 288, yeah. I think it's, it's just unfortunate I didn't give Peach a really good spell. <laughs> that or for items. <laughs> Mario, Mario is the item guy. Peach as well. Mallow is the only one I think who's going to be using FP. Yeah, because Mar- like, how much does Lucky Hammer do? Actually, that's pretty good, actually. He did 303. Yeah, but that damage is just way better. <laughs> I feel like we're actually starting to do some damage again. Keep in mind, you can be level 60 for this, and I'm only like level 30, so... That's, uh, that just goes to show you how much, how the big the curve is in this game. 
Really glad I got that hammer then. Oh. Mallow is almost dead. <laughs> Here, let's actually use a gold shroom for once. It doesn't even fully heal him anymore. <laughs> Because the back the, the the HP cap is higher now. Wait. Now I'm not well, that didn't do anything. What the fuck? Also I need FP, so let's use a moon serenade. Suddenly Mar suddenly Mario didn't do jack shit for damage. Is it, oh, is it one of those things that has, like, a lot of variants? Very possible. Mario is very tanky, though. Like, he's definitely the tankiest out of all my party members. Yeah, it's got a lot of variants. So I guess that's kind of interesting. <laughs> Attacks with a lot of variants are okay, honestly. Like, I know the lazy shell has a lot, so I'm not- I'm okay with that. Alright, it's time for a group hug, then. I must have gotten, like, the top of the variants, then. Yeah, now I did 298, so it just has a- it's, it's like the lazy shell, it just has a shit ton of variants. For no reason. We're actually using our FP for once, guys. We're not cheesing him. I'll check how much health he has next turn, probably. Oh yeah, to be fair, the Star Carol Cola does increase all your stats. Probably a mix of both, honestly. Alright, let's see how much health he has left. Oh, he's almost dead, okay. <laughs> two more star- two more galaxy blasts and he's dead. Alright, you, you can- you can- you can stop now. You're dead, bro. That was a good Jagger fight. I like how they made that one really tough. <laughs> Alright, time to fight Jackie. One of my favorite Mario RPG characters, like, across the series, honestly. <laughs> depending on- depending on how I feel, honestly, I like- I might like him more than the Master. <laughs> Smithy is gonna go crazy. Alright, let's see how- let's see how Jackie goes. One sixty! Oh my god! Is he immune to jump still? Okay, so Jackie's not immune to jump. The Jagger was. That's weird. <laughs> he has so much health that the game can't even count it. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> and this is just. This is just the first fight. Oh, oh, 640 damage. Oh my god. I need to come into this fight with like a fuck ton of 1-ups then, probably. You know what? I should probably, um... I should probably save <laughs> so I don't burn all my items by accident. They better give Smithy, like, 20,000 health, then. 
Oh no, I just realized how the fuck is how the fuck is the Culex fight gonna go now? That still kills. I can't survive a triple kick. You have to you have to perfect the block or else you're dead. I really need Peach to have her I really need comeback. If I don't have comeback, I'm not gonna be winning this. Alright, this is the one thing I'm glad this is the one thing I'm glad that the challenge isn't breaking is this fight. Because this fight absolutely deserves to be challenging. Uh, he's- no, he's- no, we already know Jinx is immune to all elements. He's immune to every element except for jump. Yeah, so if you don't perfect block, you're dead. <laughs> like, just, like, see how much damage that does? That's pretty good, actually. That's some good damage. I mean, having to grind in this would be kind of lame. I mean, then again, I'm the guy who beat Culex at, like, level 26 or whatever. Or whatever it was in the remake, so we'll see. She's not dead! Peach ain't dead yet. He lives with nine! That was a good super jump. That's the first time I got past the 13, uh, the 13 digit cap. Hmm. I kind of want to use a Star Caracola just to be safe. Okay, that confirms, that confirms my theory that, uh, yeah. He's, he's immune to that. Yeah, I'll just keep using Super Jump then. Nah, I dropped the cap that time. I'll tattle him in a few turns. Actually, next turn, then. We'll see how much health he really has. Use Galaxy Blast. Not, not Ice Blast. This gives, me, this gives me good super jump practice. Nope, I dropped it again. Oh, bye, Peach. <laughs> I do want to. I do want to see how much health he has, though. He has eight thousand. Uh-oh. Is Mallow dead too? Mallow's also dead. I probably do need to level up so that Peach can get her revive skill. Because otherwise we're not gonna win this. Yep. He, he has lots. He has lots of health. I want to say he had like 15,000 actually. Okay, good. I perfect blocked that time. Alright, yeah, that's some good damage. That's what we like to see. Mm. 
might be in my best interest to heal Mario. You never know. Good. Hey, I mean, that damn, that damn just keeps getting better. Oh, and now Mallow's dead. Bye. <laughs> Time to keep spamming that, uh, that super jump. That's good. Um, I'm gonna use a moon serenade and then group hug. He just- oh, and I forgot to fucking block. Great. Okay, well, last one up, then. So, if <laughs> anything after this, uh, we're kind of boned. Mario hasn't died yet, so he's gonna be pumping out all the damage. All right. Oh, thank God Peach is able to live that. Gets just enough to live a frickin' uh, dripple kick. Now, on the other hand, can't. So yeah, we gotta be careful. Oh, he missed. Nice. Does triple kick count as a jump move now or something? Is that why? <laughs> that can't be why. That'd be, that'd be a pretty funny reason, though. Oh, yeah, uh, we're dead. <laughs> we are so dead. <laughs> nope, Peach lived again. Now we're now we're officially dead. <laughs> now we're actually dead. I didn't even heal. I didn't even heal properly. Heal again. Yeah, therapy really does not heal that much, does it? All right, fine. Just go for it. Just go for it. Oh, yeah, we're dead. Yep. Alright, well, it was, uh, it was worth a try, I guess. <laughs> well, rip. He does give you, he does give you unique dialogue, though, if you run away from him. So, yeah, that, that fight's not happening. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, I guess we're not being Jinx right now. Because I can easily whoop his ass three times in the remake and the original, but... 
Not in this version. Anyways, uh, let's go back to... Let's go back to the frickin' Land's End. Surely enough, there's gotta be some good post-game content in this, right? How much money do I have? Yeah, not very much. <laughs> I don't have any money, actually. In fact, that means I can't even take the spring back out to the entrance. I have to take the long way back. How, how unfortunate is that? Well, you're not getting my money anyway, so fuck you. Neither are you guys. You guys aren't getting my money either. This is, I think this is the first time I've actually walked back this way. Because I didn't have enough money. But the great news is you can walk back. You just have to jump on top of that chest. And then you can hit the trampoline. And it's just as fast. So did they make this any harder? Probably not. Whoops. Hold on, let me redo that. Man, why am I so slippery today? Whoops. Man, I'm, I'm really bad at this. There we go. Was that, was that good? Troop of Pin. Is the Troop of Pin still as broken as ever? Defense 12, speed 15. Oh, does it not give you the plus attack? Um, hang on. The, the only way I'm going to find out is if I look it through the code itself. Give me a sec, guys. I got to open up Lazy Shell again. Lazy Shell... 3.19. For all I know, there's another ver there's a newer version out there, but I don't know. Mm, let's look at the uh, let's look at the armor. The troop of pin is the troop of pin any good? Um, the troop of pin. Where is it at? The Troopa Pin does not give extra attack anymore. It's just defense and speed now. Damn, the Troopa Pin got hella nerfed. That sucks. It's not even worth it's not even worth that much anymore. Well, that sucks. Also also I can look at uh I can look at how much health uh, Jinx has now. <laughs> He has 12,500 health. <laughs> That's a lot of health. Oh my god. He also has 255 speed, by the way. <laughs> and he's scripted to use Vigor Boost at 3750 3, or below. Wow. So, uh... Yeah, Jinx. Jinx has a lot, let's just say. So you were kind of right, chat member. He has 12,000. He has 12,500. Crazy, huh? Anyways, this is the ideal spot for grinding frog coins, by the way. So if you reload the room and come back... Um, we're just gonna skip through all this. You can redo this minigame as many times as you want. If you, as long as you don't suck.
And if you do that... Yeah, you get five frog coins every time. You can re you can keep redoing this over and over again and get like a crap ton of frog coins this way. As long as you you know get in record time, you gotta get it under eleven seconds though. So yeah. So this 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 whenever I replay whenever I play this game that oops I just walked off. Whenever I replay this game, that's just, this is just my ideal frog coin grinding spot. I hate that, that that Koopa shell is just in the way of letting you jump. So annoying. You, like, you, ha you have to wait it out. You also have to wait for that guy, too. Alright, try not, try not to rush it too much. It's okay to wait it out. Like you're allowed to wait a little bit. Because you still get, like, under 10 seconds regardless. Yeah. Okay, so we got 54 frog coins now. Should I get up to, like, 100 or something? Maybe I'll get up to 100. I mean, how many frog coins do I even want, you know, for the end game? Whoops. I didn't even wait it out. I love how much time you can skip in this. <laughs> So as long as you get under 11 seconds, you get the frog coins, which is good. We'll come back here later, but I think that's enough for now. So, if we really want, we can um, buy some stuff at Tadpole Pond. Also, you know what I never did? I never went back to Booster Pass. Uh, I'm gonna save state, just in case. Who knows if they made Apprentice more dangerous. Let's find out. Is Apprentice any stronger? Let's find out. By smiting him. <laughs> well, I won't be able to tell. Nope, he's still a piece of cake. Those are not flower tabs, though. Wait, he can drop flower tabs? That means it's easy to grind. Oh. <laughs> Mario's kind of fucked there. Man, that's some good damage. I forgot you assholes heal. Alright, yeah, 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 yeah. Every- all these guys heal themselves. It's so annoying. They're still annoying even late game. How are you still alive, bro? Die. Alright, well that's enough of that. Alright, so what we got? We got flower, flower, star carol. What why'd they replace one of the frog coins? <laughs> That's a random change. I don't really get that, but okay. Anyways, back to, uh, Apple Pond, because we can get the last uh, melody, too, while I'm here. 
And we can talk to Frogfish just for, like, ten frog coins. It's all around, it's a good time to be alive. How many frog coins is he giving me, bro? How many frog coins? Got a Fuchsia's gem? Holy fuck, they upgraded it. Is this any good? Oh my god. Attack 10, defense 10, magic attack 10, magic defense 10, attack, magic attack, boost. Damn, okay. Who would that be good on then? Probably, uh, probably Mallow, right? They buffed, they buffed the Frog Fuchsia's reward. He gave me like 30 frog coins there. Alright, time to look up the song again because I can never remember this shit. Uh, let's see. Tadpole Pond Songs. I really need to glue these to my wall. Because <laughs> I can never remember them. Why is the quality so doo-doo? It's fine, I can I can see it. It's um I think it, I think I, I think I see what it is. And then it's, um, it's one to the right, okay. Oh, I think I fucked up, actually. I might have messed that up, actually. I cocked that up so hard. <laughs> How the hell did I do that? Okay. So what is the combination again? It's, um... Okay, so... One, two, three, four, five. I think that's it. It was just like the wrong, the wrong, uh, like, pitch. I, I think this is kind of a great way of making every Mario RPG playthrough personalized. Is you get to make your own song. I mean, I'm not a writer, so it's not going to sound amazing or anything. That's it. <laughs> there's your, uh, there's your song. Let's 
So now we can finally buy... I'm assuming we can just... That just means we can have an infinite supply of Star Apparel Colas. I'm assuming. Uh, yep, yep, I was, I was correct. We can also buy flower boxes and stuff, too. Star Caracola, yep, that's pretty much what I expected. How many frog coins I have? I have, I'm a one away from being able to buy the fucking star egg. Oh my god. Fuck this. We're going, we're going to, uh, we're going back to Land's End right now. Actually, while I'm here, I might as well, um, I might as well get the flags since I'm here. Also, there's Baby Yoshi. Pink boo flag. But I'm not mistaken, at this point in the game, the Rose Town Gardener also shows up. Yeah, I don't know when he shows up, though. He shows up, like, at the most random point in the game. I know that. Alright, all good. So, now what do I do? not really much I can do, can I? Guess we're gonna... Guess we're gonna go back to Land's End. We're gonna grind for more frog coins. Man... That was pretty good. <laughs> like, I don't know how many more times I want to do this, but I need the frog coins. Best time yet, potentially. Yeah, 2025. I'm pretty sure people get like nine seconds in this sometimes. 104 frog coins. <laughs> Good to know I can go above 99. I mean, that, that's probably a given. So, yeah. <laughs> Zach is still not- he still has not responded to my message yet. It's a very good thing I decided to stream this and not, like, lay down and watch YouTube for the rest of the night because, uh, that's pretty lame. Anyways, I tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna go to Tadpole Pond. We're gonna buy... We're gonna buy that, uh... Star Egg. You can just get a Star Egg here now. We're also gonna buy... Pea uh, Power Alls. Fear Attack on Enemy. Yeah, like, I don't need these. And now the great thing is we can actually sell the Star Caracolas now, because the Star Egg just does that, but it's reusable. So, I'll have a bit of extra money now. 
Oh yeah, let me go get my reward. I want to see if the ghost metal is any good. It's probably not. But you never know. I love how they don't even tell you. They just put it on you. <laughs> and expect you to know. Let's see. Uh, the ghost metal. All stats up 5. Inflicts fear. Inflict fear, mutes, poison, or sleep against opponent. I can inflict statuses now? Hmm. That might not be bad. I'll try it out. And now I'm gonna sell the, um... I'm gonna sell those star caracolas that I have now. Yep, there you go. I could also sell the flower box if I really wanted to. Sell the lime shroom, we don't need that. Sell the sun wrap to be. I might buy a f moon serenader too. There we go. That seems good. I feel like they kind of expect you to use the ivy shroom against bosses because poison damage is just really good. So now, double check, we have the star egg. Stars Dance to restore all HP and FP. Which I no longer have to buy from Great Guy anymore. <laughs> Although I am probably still going to do the Great Guy, um... The Great Guy quest, though. Where is this? This, this is probably one of the most weird chests in the game. Alright, thanks for making Mario Mushroom. Not bad damage. Mario is tanky now. What the hell? Oh boy, you guys are all gonna do this. Yeah, Mallow's not taking as much damage now. That's pretty good. I can't wait to s I can't wait for the Axum Rangers to kick my ass later in the game. <laughs> That's gonna be fun. Can you guys stop spamming? Yeah, let's see how much Icy Snowman does. Kinda curious. Wow. Okay. That's pretty decent, then. It's just around here somewhere. I forget. There it is. That one is pretty obscure. I tend to forget about that chest a lot when I play this game. I'm just waiting for the enemies to finish attacking me, you know? Okay, I guess rid of some of the enemies at least. You're just delaying the inevitable, you know? They are not weak to ice like I thought they'd be. Or maybe they are, I'm just dumb. Alright, so we're gonna go get this chest, which has a flower in it. Alright, and I've had enough bees for one day. <sighs> Alright. Now for this part. Honestly, I'm, I'm tempted to just get to Nimbus Land and call it a day. 
Oh, hey, it's this loadout. Are the Gekits not, um, like, absolute pushovers anymore? Because if so, that's good. <laughs> So yeah, three Galaxy Blasts kills them. I feel like you have to have Galaxy Blasts by this point in the game, right? Like, you just have to. If you don't, I'd be honestly pretty surprised. Nah, you can't make the princess sleep. You can't do that. So this loadout is basically unchanged. Cause this it's like this in the original normally. When's our next level up, by the way? And yeah, it doesn't say we're gonna learn any new spells. Like, I can't tell if that's a bug or if that's just actually true or not. But hey, I mean, we're in the 30s, which is way more than I'd have in vanilla. So, I mean, that's something, right? Oh, boy. Can you make Mario up, please? <laughs> please? Mario's the only one who isn't immune to status, because I wanted to put the frickin' ghost metal on him. One damage. The monster is mute. Oh, and more, more psychoplasm, good to see that. Alright. Alright, let's open up all these pipes and then save, because I know we're gonna have to fight Box Boy in a second here, and that's gonna be a... That's gonna be a rough one. Wait, why is Mario moving first now? Is he a speed tie with Mallow or something? That is some amazing damage, seriously. <laughs> and he's dead from the 88 damage. Hey, Bowser reached level 32. Unless he learns something, like, amazing, I probably won't be using him, though. No. Alright, thanks for waking Mallow back up. Yeah, Mario's in like a speed tie now, I think. Galaxy Blast being absolutely OP. I got an Ivy Shroom for that for free. Alright, so uh, usually you want to go in like counterclockwise order, I think. Alright, a full heal. <laughs> not fighting, not doing that. I don't care if I get something good for it. This is exactly why we saved. I knew something like that would happen.
That's actually more favorable. I think one of these loadouts also has um, a hidden chest in it. I think it's not. I don't think it's this one. Okay, another flower. Good. This chest. Oh, this is the one. I think it, there's a. There. There it is. A third flower. Let's go. I got three flowers. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Got an awakening. Get a free frog coin there. And now we can fight Box Boy and see just how bad his fight is. Explosion. <laughs> to be fair, that is what that move is called normally. Um, you know what? Let's see the star egg in action. Hmm. Yep, that is pretty damn good. Alright, let's do a power all. Oh, monster the monsters are inside. They sure are inside. <laughs> yeah, let's let's see if I can inflict poison. Well, we gotta see how much health he has. Six thousand. Hmm. Yeah, sure. Okay, I'm gonna guess he's immune to poison. Aurora beams. Oh boy, that that's not good. That did a lot of statuses. Okay, 255, 252 damage, just like that. Please don't kill Mario, please. Oh my god. <laughs> that is a lot of damage. Six forty two. Uh oh. <laughs> I think Mallow's dead. Though he lived. It's good that he lived, though. Mallow's getting bullied. Yeah, chat's not been active. Oh well, I'll put I'll put my phone right here anyway. Five thirty-two. That's very nice. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Alright, uh, we can use the star egg, I think. Oh, 
I'll probably say that I didn't hear Mallow status, but that's honestly fine. Man, they, the, the, the box boy just hates Mallow, bro. <laughs> just hates him. Mallow is fucking dead. You, what do you, why did he Mallow, bro? What did he do to you? Yeah, attack the princess. I'm more fine with that. <laughs> the princess can actually tank things, you know? Seven thirty. Wow, that's pretty damn good in terms of damage. Super jump proves to be still broken. Oh, now you're gonna bully Mario, huh? That's a pretty nasty move for him to have, honestly. Okay, yep, yeah, bye Mallow. <laughs> Fucking Carney kiss being OP as usual. Yeah, Carney kiss is just kind of a rough move. Oh, how much health does Fought so have? <laughs> That's another thing I'm wondering. He's gotta, he's gotta be dead soon, right? Sixteen hundred. That's the only move he's gonna do for the rest of the fight is Screech. <laughs> Who cares about other moves? Only Screech. Can't even, can't even have shit in Detroit, you know? I wanna keep group hogging though, you can't stop me. Much better, okay, now I can actually super jump again. <laughs> I'm fine with that. Honestly, I feel like I can tank another hit. We need to get some damage out there. Oops, I dropped it way too early. Yeah, now we can- oh, no we can't group hug, we have to star egg again. To be fair, the star caracola does increase my stats. But then again, that's kind of what the power all is for. You are an asshole.
Oh, by Mario. <laughs> it's basically just, you might as well just instant kill him at this point. Alright, he's dead. He died before Fotso died. <laughs> oh, never mind, Fotso's also dead. Fotso didn't even get to do anything because I muted his ass. Oh, I got a flower box. Um. Cheese? I'm fine with that. Mario leveled up! So we got another flower box for that. It's pretty good. Screw you, Gekets. You're in the way. Alright, we got another free frog coin. I'm back up to seven. Well, I mean, if I'm gonna buy more shit, we're gonna go grinding in Land's End again, probably. Anyways, let me save after that. That was kind of a tough one. I wonder if he made the, uh, Golden Chomp any harder. Uh, let's find out. I remember I made these guys, like, really fucking tough. Oh, they're actually called Gold Chomps now. No, they are. They are not that strong. So I made a, I made these guys really tough, and I called them, like, Screamers, and they're, like, all white, and, like, they have, like, black eyes. And I remember they have, like, they have, like, really overpowered spells. <laughs> like, Dark Star and stuff like that. I wonder if I still have that. I wonder if that's still in Luigi RPG. I don't remember. It'd be kind of cool if it was, though. Yeah, Dark Star is the strongest single target spell. <gasps> they drop gold bars. Finally, I have more money. Anyways, I'm gonna open up Great Guy's Casino. I'm not gonna go to his casino though because I haven't done the Knife Guy shit yet. But um, I will probably do Great Guy off screen because I never do all of Great Scott, Great um, uh, Great Guy's Casino on screen. The only two bosses who have Dark Star are uh, Culex and Exor, to my knowledge. There might be another boss that has it, but those are the main two guys who have it. I'm not scared of that, bro. These damn bees, they're not that threatening. Yeah, Exor can use it. Pretty sure that's the first boss who can use it. <laughs> and there's some boss in the factory that uses it, probably. Then again, Culex drains his FP like it's nothing. Because <laughs> whenever I fight Culex, he always runs out of FP. He n I can never finish a Culex fight without him burning all of that. So, someone needs to make a hack where Culex can't use all his FP up. Alright, well, let's see how how bad the Smilax fight's gonna go. What? What? How much health does Smilax have? One? <laughs> Why one? I guess it's just Big Smilax that has all the health. That's weird. Did they make this a gimmick fight? So, how bad is this fight gonna go? So, 
So the only threat here is the Mega Smilax, then. If Mega Smilax even is gonna be a threat. I don't know, let's find out. Not healing rain, you dumbass. But sure, I'll heal, I guess. I'm just gonna defend. It's a good thing I did. <laughs> I meant to do data drain. Healing rain and data drain just kind of look the same to me. Like, in terms of spelling, so I got mixed up. Yup, yup, there's all the, uh, there's, there's where all the health went. Oh, you're gonna be that kind of boss, are you? I see how this is gonna go. Ooh, it's 752. Now that's a lot of health. There goes like there goes like a tenth of Smilax's HP. Viroplasm. Oh my god, okay. Damn, bro. Alright, just keep using icy snowman then. Actually, if I had to guess, Smilex is probably weak to fire, too. I'm gonna try that. After... after she takes her turn. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Meg- I'm pretty sure Smilex is a chick. I could be wrong, though. There's a lot of- there's a lot of, like, female piranha plants in the Mario universe. Not as weak as not as weak to icy snowman though. I think it's just because Mallow has a fuck ton more magic attack though. For reference, let's use um let's use ice blast and see how much that does. Ooh, oh my god. Oh shit. That's not that couldn't be good. Still does a lot of damage though. Oh, there it is. <laughs> the dreaded petal storm. And it's dead. <laughs> yeah, can I just fact check? Can I just fact check the Mario wiki real quick? Mega smile axe. Why did that Mario wiki pop up first? It's just an it. It doesn't really have a generic- it doesn't really have, um... A, like, a gender, I think. <laughs> Smilex tried it. It used, uh, Petal Blast way too, um, way too late. <laughs> well, it is- well... In the Japanese version, Smilax is called Queen Flower, so you know that could be that could be the case. Double my experience. Uh, yes, we're gonna cheese it again. No, no. Yeah, don't mind me. Uh, saves me. It'll, have, it'll save me some grinding later. <laughs> You guys see why I never go for the lucky, the lucky Yoshi minigame? It's a seed. 
Pick up a seed. It does go in my inventory. I always found that weird that the seed is technically not a key item. It's very strange. Anyways, last thing I'm gonna do tonight is I'm probably gonna do go up the go up to Nimbus Land and call it a day. Is, it, is that a new birdie? Oh, we got two big Koopas. Two big boys. Aren't these guys weak to ice? Yep, they are. Leave. That's, uh, pretty sure that's a rename. This, this, they renamed the grinder move. That is some damage. Yep, just spam Ice Blast. Zero. Because <laughs> that's the same attack that the fucking um, Shysters used earlier in the game. Oh yeah, and they're also weak to jump, too, so... That's another fun attack for you. Man, how much health do these guys have? God. Rock? Why, rock? Why'd you throw a rock at me? <laughs> what? Okay. Sure, you do you. Okay, now he's dead. Man, he had a lot of health. But I'm still using the fucking Fuchsia Staff. Okay, that's 62. Not something I would have expected, to see the frickin' heavy troopers to throw rocks at me. Alright. He did the normal- he did the normal sky trooper attack. Okay, he's dead. Those damn Koopas. Are we really not gonna learn any new spells? This is just a sad day to be a Minus Bros fan. I think he added- yeah, he definitely added more birdies. There weren't this many normally. <laughs> also, they use flame. Too bad flame sucks at this point in the game. Why are the birdies using fire attacks now? Also, I got a Star Breeze. I don't know when that happened. Alright, it's time for another Icy Snowman. Oh yeah, they should have given- I, they should have given these guys Earthquake. Cause that is a move normally. Seventy, okay. <laughs> That's such a funny attack, I love it. Mm, that does the same as my normal jump, actually. Okay, one of them's dead. I always love this background, by the way, this, like, beanstalk- this pre-rendered beanstalk background. It's, it's great. 
Gino learns Star Shower. So you do learn new moves. Oh, oops. I did not mean to fall down that far. You know, for you, for you guys who did not grow up with this game, you would not be able to understand how janky these beanstalks are. <laughs> They're so janky to climb. Hey, but I, I, got, I got used to it, so it's fine. Another flower, okay. Er I know Peach is about to die, but whatever. He's out here just spamming weak-ass fire spells anyway. I can't be arsed to heal. Wow, that does a lot. <laughs> the princess is almost dead, Luigi. You know, I think we can use the star egg now. You can, here's the thing, you can only use it in battle, so if you want to heal, you have to get into a battle first. Why are you guys using Drain? <laughs> it's so weak, it's not a good. Use like, Corona or something, I don't know. Or Meteor. Actually, I think Corona will be too strong for these guys, but like, Meteor is fine. So that's, that's a strong ass fire move. I'd be down with that. Yeah, the. F oh, oh my god. I'm gonna be honest, I don't feel like dealing with this loadout right now. I'm just trying to climb up. Uh, oh. Oh, that's- that's a weird bug. <laughs> I ran away, and it caused both of those guys to disappear and turn into a platform. That's fucking weird, okay. Funny thing is, the Crystal and Exor both have Corona. <laughs> so, Corona and Q- uh, Corona and- or not Corona, uh, Culex and Exor surprisingly have a lot of moves in common. It's kind of funny. Oh my god, Mallow is almost dead. I can't believe Mallow's almost dead, Luigi. Yeah, Axor has Corona. Yeah, true. I mean, Axor has a lot of weird moves. Like, it has Venom Jewel for some reason. Um, it has, like... What other moves? I think it has Aurora Flash. Oh boy, I can already tell. We're gonna have a pretty tough Exor fight. The only reason why Exor is so tough is because of the fact that, um... You're fighting three bosses at once, basically. Also, that did fuck all. <laughs> yeah, why is the mouth called Neo Squid? That's that's another good question. I think it was like a, it, it was some weird mistranslation, but nobody seems to know why. Nobody seems to know what the mistranslation was even from. Man, those, those, guys, those heavy troopers, they take a while to kill. So when's Mallow gonna learn his next spell, huh? Erp. Alright, let me, let me do the funny real quick. Shit. Game kind of acted a bit fucky there. 
Bruh. All right, take take your turns. I don't got time for this shit. Mario! Does Mar is Mario gonna learn anything, though? I mean, to be honest, I feel like Mario's moveset kind of peaks, though. I feel like it kind of peaks at, like, Super Flame. Because it gets really lame once he gets Ultra... Ultra Flame and Ultra Jump. Uh, is the Magic Scarf any good? Oh my god. Yes, it is. Nulls all magic damage. <laughs> well, elemental damage. If anything, I feel like that'd be better on Mallow. Well, this gives him a magic attack boost, though. Hmm. That's pretty good, although. That's, that's pretty good. I like that. There's so many good there's so many good accessories in this game, man. Get my two free flowers here. Alright, well. You know, funny thing, as a kid, I never noticed that the birdies are actually just people in bird costumes. I always thought, like, that was their teeth. <laughs> I thought their, like, teeth was moving. It's obviously a lot more obvious in the Switch remake. But, yeah. You know, we need a- we need a third bird enemy called the Green Bird, and it needs to know, like, poison spells or something. <laughs> or- or wind spells, either's fine. Someone make that in a hack. You don't have to give me credit. <laughs> Alright, well... As attractive as Valentina is, we gotta go whoop her ass. So we'll we'll do that in the next episode probably. Let's get uh let's get this easily missable chest. I think they moved this chest in the remake. I think they just put it up here. They didn't you don't have to make a blind jump for it anymore, but I could be wrong. Alright, so we're gonna finally have new, um, new stuff. Lucky Hammer. Oh, man. It's really tempting to get this. I think I'm gonna stick with the Lucky Hammer, honestly. The War Fan for Peach. I mean, sure, I'll give that to her. Gives her extra speed. I think it's finally time we sell the Forest Cloak. That thing has served us so well throughout this game. Also, the trooper pin actually sucks. Like, it doesn't it doesn't sell for anything. Oh yeah, we can also sell our gold bar now. We get basically 8,000 bucks. Wait, I don't accidentally sell the seed, by the way. I'm gonna sell the star breeze. Actually, I- wait, I think I've had this all game and I just never used it. <laughs> I probably should- oh yeah, sell the Star Carol Cola. Buy. And let's buy some more 1-ups. We really need 1-ups. There we go. Electroli- Electrizer. Let me guess, there's gonna be a fire one in the, uh, volcano? Nimbus Vest. Defense 10, Magic Attack 5, Magic Defense 14, weak to ice. Um, is that better than what Mallow has right now? Uh... Debatably, it does get an extra magic attack. So that's there's that. The prince cape. Wait, why can Mallow and Gina wear the prince cape? <laughs> oh, 
Oh, also you can buy the Fuchsia Staff here. Ooh, the Nimbus Staff. Yes, please. Give me that shit right now. Look at that increase. Oh my god. Mallow's weapons are actually good in this game. Bye, Fuchsia Staff. You served us well. I'm upgrading to a better one. You don't have to get the spike link for Bowser, the arm cannon for Geno, and... Yeah, I think I'm fine with this. Should I sell the Frosterizer? I think I will. Now I have max coins! Yay! At least I won't have to worry about money for a while. Oh yeah, let's see if we can get the, uh, let's see if we can get the good dream that gives us two red essences first try. Be nice if I get it. Nope, I got Yoshi. I like Yoshi, though, so that's fine with me. Alright. I've definitely saved the Nimbus land a lot in my time of playing this game. I didn't want to stop at Bean Valley, though, because I've done so many fucking rando runs where I just stop at Bean Valley before Smilax, and that's kind of a pet peeve of my own. But yeah, Marissa's kind of tooting it up over here. She's, uh, she's kind of having a bit too much fun over in the corner there. So anyways, guys, um, thank you for watching uh, Marb G Masters. In the next episode, we're going to, um, we're going to do more of this game. We're going to probably beat Barrel Volcano. I don't know if we're going to do Bowser's Castle. That might be its own episode, honestly. So, yeah. Anyways, it looks like Zach didn't message me after all, so he was probably away today. So, uh, that's probably the only stream I'm going to do tonight. I could do Tomodachi, but I'm talking tired, man. I want to go rest. But... If another stream happens, it might. You never know. Uh, we'll see. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys uh, tomorrow. We're going to um, potentially play more of this game. We'll see. And uh, maybe expect a Terraria stream tomorrow night, too. So, uh, I'll see you guys then.